What happens when a diabetic takes Moringa for two weeks? Moringa is a nutrient-dense plant that has been studied for its potential health benefits. According to health experts, Moringa contains proteins, vitamins, and minerals, making it useful to fight a variety of health conditions. So in this video, we are going to explore the health benefits of consuming Moringa, especially for diabetes. What happens when a diabetic patient takes Moringa for two weeks? To get the answer to this question, stay with us to the end of the video. What is Moringa? Moringa is a plant that is native to India and other countries. It is also known as the drumstick tree, the miracle tree, the bin oil tree, or the horseradish tree. Moringa has been used for centuries due to its potential health benefits. It is a nutrient-dense plant that contains proteins, vitamins, and minerals, making it useful to fight a variety of health conditions. Moringa is typically grown in India, Ethiopia, the Philippines, Sudan, West Africa, the eastern part of Africa, South Africa, Asia, Latin America, the Caribbean, Florida, USA, and the Pacific Islands. The tree originated in India and Bangladesh. It grows well in semi-arid, tropical, and even subtropical climates. Moringa trees thrive in tropical climates and require between 6 and 8 hours of direct sunlight per day slightly acidic to pH neutral soil and temperatures ranging from 77 degrees Fahrenheit to 95 degrees Fahrenheit. Moringa has been studied for its potential benefits in managing blood glucose levels in people with diabetes, reducing cholesterol levels in the blood, promoting digestive health, and preventing constipation, and protecting the liver against non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Moringa also contains compounds that have antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties, which can help protect against oxidative stress and inflammation. Moringa can be incorporated into your diet in various ways, such as eating Moringa leaves raw in salad, adding Moringa powder to smoothies or oatmeal, or using Moringa seed oil for cooking or as a dressing for salads. Moringa supplements are also available in various forms, including capsules, tablets, and powders. It is crucial to remember that both the amount and the amount of Moringa ingestion can change depending on your individual dietary requirements and health status. A healthcare practitioner should always be consulted before making any major dietary changes or adding new supplements. Biologically active compounds in Moringa. Moringa contains a wide range of bioactive substances in several sections of the plant, including the leaves, the roots, seeds, and green pods. This species provides carbohydrates that are excellent for a variety of nutritional formulations. Moringa plants have been found to be high in phenolic compounds as well as proteins. Not only that, but these plants are also rich in lipids like polyunsaturated fatty acids. Moringa species leaves contain a variety of bioactive chemicals including phenolics, flavonoids, alkaloids, terpenes, and sterols. Flavanol and glycoside are two types of flavonoid molecules. What happens when a diabetic takes Moringa for two weeks? Moringa, a potent superfood, has been investigated for its possible health benefits, including its influence on diabetes. According to a review research published in Frontiers in Pharmacology, supplementing with 20 grams of the powder of Moringa oleifera leaf for at least two weeks could enhance postprandial blood glucose levels in those with prediabetes or diabetes. However, it is important to note that the study was conducted on animal models of diabetes and the effective dose of leaf extracts of Moringa oleifera was found to be 100 to 300 milligrams per kilogram. While most studies have reported positive findings, a randomized controlled study in Thailand found that 4 grams of Moringa daily for 28 days did not reduce blood sugar levels in individuals with type 2 diabetes. What is type 2 diabetes? Type 2 diabetes is a chronic disease that affects the manner our body regulates glucose, which is, as you know, a vital source of fuel for your body. Type 2 diabetes occurs when the body either persists in the effects of insulin the hormone that regulates the flow of glucose into cells of the body or produces insufficient insulin to maintain healthy blood glucose levels. Type 2 diabetes can develop when the body develops insulin resistance. 
As a result of this resistance, cells are unable to take glucose and convert it into energy. It is worth mentioning that individual responses of people suffering from diabetes to Moringa may vary, and it is always advisable for diabetes patients to consult with their healthcare provider before making any changes to their treatment plan or incorporating new supplements. Also, Moringa has been further studied for its potential to help manage type 2 diabetes. A clinical trial published in the American Journal of Health System Pharmacy found that Moringa oleifera may help lower blood sugar levels in patients with type 2 diabetes. Another study showed that taking 1.5 teaspoons or around 7 grams of Moringa leaf powder every day for a few weeks reduced fasting blood sugar levels significantly. Moringa has several potential benefits for diabetes management. The first and foremost benefit is blood sugar control. Moringa leaves are rich in compounds like isothiocyanates and chlorogenic acid, which have been shown to help regulate and stabilize blood sugar levels. These compounds can lower fasting blood sugar levels and improve glucose tolerance. Then comes the antioxidant activity. Diabetes is associated with increased oxidative stress and damage to cells and tissues. Moringa contains high levels of antioxidants, such as flavonoids and vitamin C, which can help reduce oxidative stress and inflammation in people with diabetes. When coming to anti-inflammatory properties, chronic inflammation is common in individuals with diabetes and can lead to complications. Moringa has anti-inflammatory properties that can help reduce inflammation and improve overall health. Diabetes often leads to abnormal lipid levels, including elevated cholesterol and triglyceride levels. Moringa has been found to lower these lipid levels, leading to improved cardiovascular health in people with diabetes. Moringa helps in weight management support too. Obesity is a significant risk factor for the development and progression of type 2 diabetes. Moringa contains compounds that can help in weight management by reducing appetite, enhancing metabolism, and increasing fat breakdown. Another benefit of Moringa is protection against complications. Diabetes can lead to various complications such as diabetic neuropathy and nephropathy. Moringa has shown potential in protecting against nerve damage and maintaining kidney health. However, it is crucial to emphasize that while Moringa may have some benefits for managing diabetes, it should not be used in place of current medical therapies. Before making any modifications to your type 2 diabetes management strategy, you should always contact a healthcare practitioner. The Scientific Mechanism of Action of Moringa Against Diabetes As you know by now, Moringa leaves contain several bioactive components. These include quercetin, camphorol, chlorogenic acid, and isothiocinates that have been shown to bring down high blood sugar levels in diabetic individuals. Quercetin and camphorol in Moringa extracts bind to alpha amylase and alpha glucosidase enzymes, preventing them from breaking down complex carbohydrates into simple glucose molecules. This helps curtail intestinal absorption of glucose Meanwhile, quercetin, camphorol, and chlorogenic acid work together to further reduce the intestinal absorption of glucose. Isothiocinates found in Moringa are believed to be the main anti-obesity and anti-diabetic bioactives. They may help prevent and treat type 2 diabetes and obesity. These mechanisms help prevent a steep rise in blood sugar levels after a meal making Moringa a potentially beneficial addition to a diabetic treatment plan. So how do you add Moringa to your diet? Moringa can be incorporated into your diet in various ways. Here are some popular suggestions. Moringa leaves. Moringa leaves can be eaten raw in salads, added to rice or pasta dishes, or used in an, as an ingredient in juices, shakes, and smoothies. Moringa powder. Moringa powder can be sprinkled on top of salads, mixed into yogurt or oatmeal, or added to smoothies. Moringa green pods. Moringa pods can be boiled and eaten like green beans or sliced and added to stir fries. Moringa oil. 
Moringa seed oil can be used for cooking or as a dressing for salad. Moringa supplements. Also, Moringa supplements are available in various forms, including capsules, tablets, and powders. A point to think about is that the dosage and frequency of Moringa consumption may vary depending on your specific dietary needs and health condition. It is always a good idea to consult with a healthcare professional before making any significant changes to your diet or incorporating new supplements. Other health benefits of Moringa. Here are some of the potential benefits of Moringa. Moringa has antioxidant and anti-inflammatory effects. This plant contains compounds that have antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties, which can help protect against oxidative stress and inflammation, which is quite interesting. Also, this magical plant helps in lowering cholesterol. Moringa may help reduce cholesterol levels in the blood, which can lower the risk of heart disease. Moringa seed oil has been shown to have healing properties for skin wounds and may also benefit hair health. When it comes to digestive health, Moringa leaves and pods are rich in fiber, which can promote digestive health and prevent constipation. This plant may help protect the liver against non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Also, Moringa contains compounds that may help prevent the development of cancer cells. Moringa has been studied for its potential to help prevent and treat cancer. Some experts believe that extracts of Moringa leaves, bark, and numerous other plant parts may have cancer-killing abilities. Moringa has a number of cancer-fighting chemicals, including isoquercetin, camphorol, as well as remnitin. So, now you know that Moringa is an important, versatile, medicinal plant that has been studied for its potential health benefits. More and more research have been carried out to explore anti-diabetic and more medicinal benefits of Moringa. <laughs> well, there I was, trying to impress everyone with my amazing dance moves at the party. <laughs>